Yes, he's bedded down. Okay, he just got up. You see his chest, the two front legs? Mm -hmm. Okay, can you hit him where the neck meets the chest? More to the right leg. And that brush is not in the way, right? The brush is not going to bother you. That's it. That's it. He just went down. That's a hell of a hey. sable. No, wait a second. <laughs> <laughs> Well done, sir. It's not every day that your first animal in Africa is a beautiful sable bull. Before anybody else touches him, you can hand me the rifle. You can be the first person to touch him and, you know, appreciate it for what it is. You guys are in Africa and you just connected on a beautiful sable. Beautiful. Thank yes, it you. absolutely is. Yep. I hope you got enough wall space. All right. It is uh, late June of 2024, and we are privileged to be back in the Northern Cape on our home base, and uh, we are we are honoured to welcome the the Lily Clan, Mr. Steve, Mike, and Matt um, on their first African adventure. We've actually not had. Um, the opportunity to do an introduction to our safari. So I think this is gonna double up as an introduction and obviously we are sitting behind a phenomenal sable. Mr. Steve was first on the gun today and um, just a, a textbook first shot on this sable. There was actually no need for any follow-up shots. The old 270 combined with those Viper bullets are definitely a force to be reckoned with. Um, Mr. Steve, 
it is a it is a privilege and an, and an honor to be sitting here behind an animal like this we we spoke about that earlier on many folks dream dream of coming to africa and here we are today sitting behind one of africa's most majestic animals um, a beautiful bull phenomenal secondary growth that we talked about a little bit earlier comes later on in their lives um, not a super super old old bull but a bull that's abs absolutely in his prime and just gorgeous uh, definitely past the point of being just a mature bull he's an absolute stud um, and what a way to open up your your first ever african safari with an animal like this mm -hmm. um, it is a great privilege and an honor and i keep saying that but it truly is and i think many people oversee that and they don't they don't realize what what it is to be uh, you know lifelong dreams coming to yeah. life here since I've been a little boy, I've dreamt of this. Yes, sir. It's an absolute honor for us to be here with you guys, you and your two sons. Yep. To share it with them, it couldn't be any better. Yeah. And he is a beautiful, beautiful animal. Absolutely. That happened fast, very, very early on in our safari. We barely left camp. But when a bull like this steps out, you don't pass on it just because it's the first day. You've got to take what the bush gives you. We spoke about that earlier on and when the bush presents a, a gorgeous bull like that you don't sit on it and you know say oh well i'll catch the next one yeah that that's not going to happen no. here no you tell me hey he's a good one and uh we're all in and look at him yep couldn't yeah. couldn't be uh any happier yeah well, beautiful beautiful animal mr steve mike matt thank you guys for trusting us uh, i'm excited for what the the next few days are going to hold and uh, I hope we have a blessed safari ahead of us but if it starts out like this we can it could for me it could end right here and it's all worth all the, the time and dreams we put into this congratulations Mr. Yep. Steve thank you you made a hell of a shot Thanks. phenomenal appreciate it yep. nice to get it started and let my boys uh, have their turn Yep. And hopefully they're lucky enough to shoot a beautiful animal also. I'm sure it's going to be uh, one of many. So Sable, thank, we have plenty. You. No problem, sir. Appreciate it.